truth. Hello, good morning and welcome back to Seven Kids and a Husband. We are back from our vacation, right back into the reality. A lot of things to do today. Um, oh, on my lip, I don't have purpose. This was my little daughter, Mia. Um, to all of you who have little kids, you know that when you breastfeed, those little hands can be weapons if you don't clip the nails freshly. So yeah. She grabbed on my mouth, this is what happened. I was bleeding, now I look like this. Awesome, this is how I have to walk around now. Whatever, um, I am right now on my way to Samira school because her teacher wants to talk to me really bad. I don't think Sammy did something, that wouldn't be her, but she also 16 and you never know what they're doing while they're hidden puberty. Not hidden are in puberty so we go there now look what the problem is after that I have to put the rental I'm in right now back before 10 o'clock and I'm supposed to meet Louis there he gonna pick me up and the rest of the day we will see what happened I don't know yet but I'm sure it will be a busy one because always when you come back from vacation it's busy so let's go home I had a dream, we were sipping a whiskey need Highest floor of the Bowery, and I was high enough So I'm back from her teacher um, She have a new teacher this year Which, she is one lovely person She is a very, very, very nice woman And she just told me that Sami is doing awesome and that she's surprised That after all the things Sami went through already this year She's one of the best in her grade and she actually just wanted to talk to me about how to react if something happened to Sammy because she feel guilty because the day Sammy went to the hospital Samira told her that she have a bad headache and she told Sammy that um, school is over in 15 minutes and then she should just go home we talked about it she know now what to do how to who to call and what to Whatever, she knows how to react. Now, um, yeah, now I'm on my way to put the rental back. And then we see what Lewis has planned or what's the next step. is back Louis picked me up even though you all know I drive a van I feel so low now and the car is so low and I have a stick so, I should get the white car again yes mm, it was not ours I just rented it now we have our green car back, okay? Yes. It's not a bad car as well. Right? Ugh. Where's your backpack? shopping now it's already noon enjoying the fall view because the sun is shining and everything is so colorful it's really beautiful and yeah yeah I'm getting sick I can feel it my throat kind of hurt my nose is I'm getting sick yay so guys I have a question for you I don't know how, but here in the front, my 
my hair really got short and I don't know why because it was like this long and now it's short um, I have no idea why it's just, it's just short and there are no like knots in it or something there what they're brushed so but they they're really short so I wanted to ask because mommy said because I want to cut it so it grows back in the same length but mommy said I shouldn't cut it I should just put hairpins in there but now I want to oh, ask bless you you guys what to do you should make your hair short but look the hair in my back is really long it's like till here and the hair in the front done I don't know how it, but it's just so short so I want to cut it even so it grows even and mama says don't cut it just put hairpin in there but I think that later on I will regret it that I didn't cut it I think you will regret cutting it because you have a very round face comment down below Yeah. <laughs> Come here. So now we're going home because I gotta cook. Good. We're hungry. Right? She said yes. I bet. So now we're going home because mommy has to cook because we're very hungry because we didn't eat so much today because we're everyone everyone's hungry I gotta cook yes. but it's not true they had breakfast they had lunch she has snacks in her hand right now no I don't <laughs> so guys while I'm driving home I want to use that opportunity to tell you all something um where do I start what do you mean you don't know this channel is called Seven Kids and a Husband and sometimes in life things change and things are different how you say it? how you things go in a different direction than you thought they would and I want to thank you all for awesome too. I want to thank you all for awesome three years being with us, following seven kids and a husband, cheering us up in all these bad times we had, being with us while Lorenzo was so sick, being with us while Samira was so sick, um, while Louis' mama died and during Mia's birth. Y'all are a big part of our life, but maybe the time came that we have to say bye and let seven kids and a husband go to sleep. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know yet, but I 
there's a possibility this channel um, will not get updated no more. But I just noticed it makes me very sad. It's sad, right? I don't know until now. Hmm. I think I have to think about it again because I just noticed it makes me super sad thinking about not having this channel no more. So much things going on in my life. Changes and yeah. I don't know, forget about that. <laughs> I have to think about this very well again. I don't know right now what to do, what to do. Whatever, let's go home.